any other uh, you or how did you said how uh, he he viran was truly the hero uh, what, what do you think i mean i mean if we really have to look at what people are, are generally engulfed in in terms of problems and what what was it and then who actually came to their aid if if we like have to look at the last one year since we we just finished 2022 how was it by i mean see for each problem uh, i always recommend a different solution okay depending on the nature of the problem for example this year i i did have a lot of inquiries for health issues oh. and uh, when we i you know directed them towards the temple a shiva mm-hmm. temple called shri vanjil oh. okay and uh, we call it the health shiva just so that it's easy for everybody to mm. uh, remember because it's a tamil name uh, it's called shri vanjanatha swami temple and okay. there is mangalambika there So this is one very very ancient temple where uh, Shivalinga, um, you know, they say Lord Shiva himself rides on Yama. Oh. And below the Shivalinga there is a yantra, which is again consecrated by the rishis, and that yantra symbolizes the nervous system of the body. Oh. So you know everybody, mm. all of us are con- we are what we are because of our nerves, right? Correct. So it's like the nervous system itself is uh, governed by him there. and chitragupta the record keeping uh, energies right they are also there so the chitragupta temple is also there so here the, we always say in sanskrit purva janma kritam papam vyadhi rupena peeditam which means whatever you have done as past life bad karmas affect you in this life through health issues okay as and as chronic health issues oh. uh, nagging health issues or critical health issues So such such uh, health concerns we have always directed them to Shri Vanjam Temple, the Health Shiva Temple. I'll say that that's better, and we've got phenomenal results. Like the duration of hospitalization has reduced. Oh, and devot- uh, I would say devotees. I don't want to say clients because once exactly. they believe in uh, God and they go for puja, they become a devotee. Hmm. So such clients or devotees have actually Amazing. reduced like 60 days hospital, 90 days hospital, okay. you know, ICU, and spending lakhs of rupees. forget about spending not able to eat a morsel of food or uh, you know all such souls have got very good relief uh, with this temple and the medicine intake has reduced and uh, they are getting back to normalcy lot of surgeons get pujas done before oh. they do perform major complicated surgeries that's nice yeah, okay yeah even for deliveries and all we get lot of inquiries you know we want a safe delivery let's do a health shiva puja oh so we do that and uh, any health issue any health issue as something as simple as uti urinary tract infection to very complicated cancer uh, bone cancer oh my god yeah blood cancer all of this and tumors tumors also all of this they have got very good relief and uh, we've seen excellent feedback so for health it is the health shiva temple I mean that's amazing what you told about the health Shiva. Uh, I mean I I don't know audience if if you really noted something here. Uh, she did say that even doctors do come and get a puja done. So which means uh, I know where probably your mind is just taking you all right now. But this is something that's that's amazing that even doctors are believing in this as a science. I mean wow. I mean. this is something really uh, which i always wanted to uh, you know literally see from my own eyes or even believe something like this that even they believe in this as a science and not just in terms of okay a mere ritual oh. see they look at it as science because they understand that there is a yantra below the shivalinga and it's like but it's more of faith exactly yeah. so they understand mm-hmm. that okay they are skilled they know their job and they are, they may be experts in surgery and lot of that but uh in spite of all that they know there's something more to it correct god and that energy has to heal their hands will only work if the energy is willing to heal correct yeah so that is what they have understood so many artists i know prithika mm. who are basically very talented okay. highly skilled excellent in singing mm. and uh, they have the grip on the sw- uh, swaras and all excellent but they don't have the limelight they don't have the platform to showcase it's only because the the element of god's grace in them or their planets or the karma is not letting them mm-hmm. so you know that yeah. is where everybody should understand that we may be excellent in our 
uh, skills, talents, or profession. But you know, unless and until we have the grace, we may not get the best platform. Um, so that is where you know, all of us have to, with unhesitatingly, see God's grace. True. And very consciously see God's grace. Very true. Make an effort. Make an effort. You join courses. You do so many things, right? Why can't you just make an effort to get some puja done in a temple or go visit personally? Correct. Or sit and sit, sit with the japa mala and do your japas. Correct. Uh, read up about it and you know don't do it blindly. Try to understand the energy and do it. Correct. It works oh, that's so beautiful. I mean, you said it so beautifully, actually. <laughs> hmm. Then, um, yeah, health. You said was one one of the like key concerns one. that one uh, <coughs> looked. I mean, what you saw uh, last, last year, one, yes. last last one year.